it going? Nick from Virginies, and this is one, one of the last of my two overtones that I got for a box of them from before Christmas. And it's Overtone Northern Hemisphere, an IPA coming in at 6.6%. It's interesting, uh, not 6.66, not 6 I remember um, Asmex. I think other couple other be, other breweries have done six hundred and sixty six ABVs metal themed beers. Whether they can measure that accurate, accurately or not, I don't know. It's probably a gimmick, but who cares? Oh, uh, anyway, enough of that. More about this. So it's got you cannot you cannot cryo mosaic mosaic cryo and Simcoe. Uh, that sounds suspiciously like a Westie to me. Yeah, those. Uh, West Coast IPA, IPA hops, generally speaking. Not too sure. I think Mosaic and Simcoe, I don't know. I, I, I think it's, but let's see what's in the grain bill. Barley, oats some wheat. Now I'm hoping, I'm hoping this is going to be one of their beautiful hybrid beers. So with some of the bitterness and the pineiness of a West Coast, coupled with the, the, the fruitiness and the, the the mouthfeel of a, of a New England IPA, Mountain IPA or Midwest Coast IPA, as my Beergeneers partner Emmett fittingly christened them. I think he's got the trademark on that. It's better than Mountain IPA anyway, which will tends to be the term used in the craft beer communities. So I'm getting a lovely whiff off that already. Um, it's what I like. It's hazy. Um, I've seen slightly hazier, but it's pretty, pretty damn hazy. Got a finger of loose white head there. Um, let's go for the nose. Oh, so that is really, really powerful stone fruit. Peach. Apricot and nothing, nothing, nothing much else. It's it smells, you know, the aroma is gorgeous. Really, I tell you what it is. Well, um, you know, you get um, what's it called when you get the little uh, fruit cocktail? Yeah, so it's like fruit cocktail. So there's a mixture of overripe tropical fruit mixed with overripe peach. Oh. <laughs> That's beautiful. I've not, I haven't had a beer with that sort of nose for a while. Um, I don't know where that's coming from. Where would that powerful peach be coming from? I don't know what eucanot is. I thought that was like a piney one. It must be coming from the eucanot. I'll need to look that up afterwards. Anyway, let's dive in. See what it tastes like. Chin chin. Oh, okay. So some of that stone fruit, the stone fruit's there at the front, and then you've got like a a bit of pine afterwards. Oh, but the two work so well. Oh, that's amazing. <laughs> oh. Oh yeah. So yeah, you've got the stone fruit to the front, but it's not just one dimensional. Quite a bitter, piney, resinous, um, you know, spruce forest sort of, oh yeah, it's still going. Pineyness around there. Oh yeah, <laughs> really powerful. So there's there's stone fruit going on, peach, overripe peach, but at the same time, there's like almost like pine needle essence. Very very pretty full on. But it's delicious. I'm really enjoying it. It's it's a bit of challenge. That's really, really good. The body is um Bodies to med medium light, I'd say. Carbonation is is light. Um, oh, 
So that is exactly what I want. When I saw the hops on the can, when I saw the grain bill, I thought, yeah, this is going to be a mashup between an east, east, a west coast and an east coast. I think absolutely is that. Although the pininess is really powerful. I think the pininess must be coming from the um, from the Yukonot. But I still have no idea where that peach is coming from. No idea at all. Cinco Mosaic, I've never got that from those hops before. But like it was like that podcast I was listening to, you know, you can get different batches, so who knows. But anyway, it's bloody good. That's all that matters. Rating? Do you know what? I'm going to give that a 9 out of 10. I really, really like that. Um, have I ever given a non-double IPA 9 out of 10? I don't know. Now I have. Yeah, so it's near the top of any beer I've ever... It's, it's absolutely superb. Absolutely superb. 9 out of 10, the Northern Hemisphere. Nice can art as well. Beautiful can art. Well done, Overtone. Only one, only one left. And then, you know, we're going to have to... Uh, Get back on and see what else you got going on on the web store. So I can't be doing without overtime. Thanks for watching. Until next time. Cheers.